Let me tell you, a couple of months ago I was in the worst time of my life. I lost my job, was depressed, gaining weight, many sleepless nights crying and asking God why he had abandoned me. Until I found Neville and discovered God is in me, and if I felt abandoned, I had done that to myself. I started with meditation, using music sometimes, and sometimes just silence. I had one visualization that actually made me cry out of happiness while in a deep state that I truly felt myself to be living in. In that state, I imagined me telling my best friend I was gainfully employed. I also imagined my friend happy telling me she was out of debt, and that she had never been happier. I am seeing this happen in her life now. She was so anxious about her car, which was a bad deal, Corolla for $700 a month. She had been trying to get rid of that car and payment for months, with no success, many dealers telling her that with her credit, nothing could be done. Well, they didn't expect her friend to be God, did they? Two weeks after this particular meditation, she went to a car dealer and came straight to my house to show me her new 2019 Mustang, for $480 a month, with 40k miles. She was glowing and said to me, I can't believe I found this car, it was always my dream to have a sports car. It was God, a blessing, I am sure, I feel it. I congratulated her and said, it was definitely God. I lost 20 pounds in three weeks just by decreeing, I'm 140 pounds. No gym, no diet. I watched a video on Neville Goddard's teaching and the woman, Rita Kaminsky, mentioned this physical change possibility. I thought why not? I was 160 pounds, and started saying since that I'm 140. I kept saying whenever I remembered, wow I'm losing so much weight, everything I eat makes me lose weight, I am 140 pounds, and really believed in it so much that I never worried to weigh myself. Until one day, about a week after starting these affirmations, I did, and I was 150. My jaw dropped. Now I'm 140 pounds, as of today. My life has turned around completely and now I have three job options and was introduced to a recruiter who is now connecting me with a bunch of other recruiters in my industry. They are calling me. The job I for so long wanted reached out to me yesterday out of nowhere, I didn't reply to their email and you know what they did? They called me and did a phone interview on the spot, which went beautifully. Today they called me again and scheduled the last round of interviews and I already know the job is mine. I just have this feeling of no resistance at all. I'm not nervous, I'm calm, I'm blissful. Read Neville and listen to his lectures. Avoid watching YouTubers. I watched Rita Kaminsky in the beginning to pump me up because her energy is great, but now I stick to Neville only, listen to Neville's tapes and read his books, The Pearl of Great Price is Neville's best lecture. But do listen to them all. I listen to them repeatedly, when I'm driving, cooking, cleaning the house. I meditate every single day, daydream, and think positively about all things in my life all throughout the day. I play pretend in my head and if negative thoughts or judgments of people pop up, I immediately flip them to positive thoughts, not judging or criticizing the human me for thinking negative to begin with, I just flip the negative to positive and give attention to it. I do sats and had a hard time in the beginning thinking of it as a task, now I just lay my head on my pillow, in the position I feel comfortable to sleep in, smile, close my eyes, and have beautiful thoughts. I wake up and smile, and in my head I say thank you, then when I get up and as soon as my feet hit the floor, I say in my head, thank you. Today is the day. It's a beautiful journey and I've never felt better. I had met this guy on Bumble who I immediately clicked with, but after a couple of amazing dates, I had doubts in my mind. I asked him to leave my house. After that I texted him back and we had a couple more dates, he then told me he didn't want to see this going anywhere and then called me telling me he made a mistake. We had another two months of amazing dates, 
but at that point I was head over heels and he was slowly telling me he wanted to take things slow. He said he didn't want to jump straight into a relationship. He was joining the army and had a three-week holiday booked. The last time I met him before manifesting him back he told me it is not going to work, we went no contact. That's when I came across my manifestation and law of assumption. I watched a Rita Kaminsky video and read some Neville Goddard. Let me tell you that all of your feelings are valid, you are human, you are allowed to have doubts and allowed to cry and miss your SP and feel every emotion. But the main point is after all of that is done is to tell yourself that whatever you desire is already done. A lot of YouTubers talk about self-concept and letting go. But let me tell you, if you do not want to focus on those things you don't have to. If you tell yourself that these things do not affect your manifestation then they won't. You can be miserable during your manifestation but as long as you remind yourself the key point that it is done, it will come to fruition. You can think about it all day, you can keep affirming, keep visualizing all day long. It is okay, there is no such thing as a state of lack. Whatever makes you feel good, works, I tried sats but for me it was quite hard to bring it into my sleep so I focused on affirmations. I only had a couple but at the end of the day it is whatever works for you. So I told myself two things. Number one, whatever he is doing, whoever he is with, he is always thinking about me. Number two, we are in a committed relationship. I would have that in my mind all the time. Even if it didn't mean anything to me. I didn't feel anything. I just kept repeating it. I would alternate that with saying, thank you, and isn't it wonderful. None of these I actually felt, none of these I actually believed, but because I kept saying it, I knew it even though I didn't believe it. I was in the wish fulfilled without believing it. A lot of people talk about how they have a turning point. Where they then let go, or suddenly start to actually feel. But I didn't. The main thing to know is that you don't have to do anything, you don't need to put in work. Why would you need to work for something that is rightfully yours? If you don't want to do any sort of techniques then you don't have to. You can literally keep feeling however you're feeling as long as at the end of it you tell yourself that it is done. Once you make the decision, it is bound to happen. Anyways, after one week of this, I got a call from him. I got more than I had even asked for. He called to tell me not only that he loves me and wants me to be his girlfriend, but also that he sees his whole future with me. Remember that the manifestation is not complete until it comes to fruition in the 3D. Do not accept anything less than what you asked for.